And I'm incredibly excited today to introduce an all-new MacBook Air with a retina display and a whole lot more. The familiar aluminum bezel of the current MacBook Air is gone. It features a 13.3-inch display, which is the perfect size for such a portable notebook. And when it comes to resolution, we've taken the pixels and quadrupled them. And even with this narrower border design, we were still able to keep the FaceTime camera at the top of the display. The MacBook Air has another new feature that customers have been asking for, and that's Touch ID. T2 features a secure enclave which protects Touch ID information. The new MacBook Air has our latest generation keyboard with keys that offer four times the stability over the previous generation, creating a modern keyboard with a more precise and responsive typing experience. And a modern keyboard deserves to be paired with a modern trackpad. So we've replaced the old diving board version with the new Force Touch trackpad. It is 25% louder it has two times more bass and wide stereo sound. In addition, it has a three microphone array, which will make those group FaceTime calls crystal clear, and it also improves the voice recognition of Siri. So the new MacBook Air has two Thunderbolt 3 ports. So from charging to data transfer to video out, it's the most versatile port ever. There's an eighth generation dual core CPU along with the latest Intel integrated graphics. And it also supports up to 16 gigabytes of faster memory, which is double the capacity of the previous Air. And SSDs that are up to 1.5 terabytes in capacity and 60% faster. It has the same great 12 hours of wireless web browsing, but now has up to 13 hours of iTunes movie playback. The new Air has an unbelievable 17% less volume than its predecessors, which is 10% thinner than the previous Air. And yet, with all these new features, the new MacBook Air weighs just 2.75 pounds. So that's the new MacBook Air. With this stunning 13-inch retina display, touch ID, advanced security, a force touch trackpad, and so much more. So we're really proud to say today that every new MacBook Air is made from 100% recycled aluminum. And we'll start at $1199, making it the most affordable Retina Mac we've ever offered. You can order it starting today, and it will be available next week. I can't wait to tell you about the biggest update ever to the new Mac Mini. Now, I'm sure you've noticed that we've given it an awesome space gray finish. The number one thing our customers wanted us to do is give it more powerful processors. So now, every Mac Mini starts with four cores. So we're also giving Mac Mini six cores processors as well. And these aren't mobile parts, no. These are higher power, eighth generation CPUs with faster graphics too. So the performance boost is incredible. The new Mac Mini goes to 32 gigs of memory. But we didn't want to stop there either. So the new Mac Mini can now go up to 64 gigs of memory. So now every Mac Mini has all flash storage. With SSDs that are up to four times faster and capacities up to two terabytes. And every new Mac Mini also has the Apple T2 security chip with its many new features, including HDVC video encode that, get this, 30 times faster with gigabit ethernet four, count them, four Thunderbolt 3 ports, an HDMI port, two USB-A ports, it can connect to almost anything. So that's the new Mac Mini with all these great new features. The entry config has eight gigs of memory, a 3.6 gigahertz quad-core processor, and a 128 gigabyte SSD. And it starts at just $7.99. You can order it starting today, and it'll be available next week. And every Mac Mini enclosure is made from you guessed it, 100% recycled aluminum. In fact, this really is the iPad we dreamed about building from the very beginning. And in this new iPad Pro, we have an LCD that stretches from edge to edge and top to bottom. This is the same take anywhere size you loved in the 10.5 inch design, but now with an 11 inch display. And it has a quarter million more pixels. And this is a new 12.9 inch iPad Pro. 
It's now almost exactly the same size as an eight and a half by 11 piece of paper. <laughs> and it's not just smaller; it's also thinner. These new iPad Pros are just 5.9 millimeters thin. With a simple glance, you can unlock your iPad, portrait, landscape, attached to a keyboard. And no matter how you use these new iPad Pros, they are always right side up. Today, you might have noticed there's no longer a home button. Well, now home button means that all those familiar gestures from the iPhone X now come to the iPad. Because these new iPad Pros are powered by the all-new A12X Bionic, and this thing is a monster. The A12X features an eight-core CPU with four performance cores and four high-efficiency cores. And with our latest generation performance controller, multi-threaded workloads can now leverage all eight of those cores simultaneously. The results of all this are pretty amazing. Single-core performance is up by 35 percent compared to last year's already really fast iPad Pros. With the increase in core count and gains in efficiency, multi-core workloads are now up to 90% faster. The A12X Bionic has an all-new Apple-designed seven-core GPU that delivers two times the performance of the previous generation. In fact, like all of our iPads, it delivers amazing all-day battery life. And this year, we have a new fast storage controller on the A12X, which enables. Up to one terabyte in storage capacity, because a high-performance computer deserves a high-performance connector. And so, in these new iPad Pros, we're moving to USB-C, <laughs> or connecting to high-resolution external displays up to 5K. And also, for the first time on these iPad Pros, we now support charging out over USB-C, so you can even charge your iPhone when you're on the go. And with these new iPad Pros, the second-generation pencil has been completely redesigned. The new Apple Pencil attaches magnetically. To the iPad Pro, it automatically pairs and starts charging wirelessly. <laughs> Tapping the screen with the Apple Pencil will wake the iPad Pro and launch instantly into the Notes app. And this year, there's a whole new way of interacting with the Apple Pencil. Just tap twice on it to switch modes. In Notes, you can switch between your current tool and the eraser. And in other apps, this behavior will be customizable, which puts even more control into our users' hands. Four-speaker audio, and this time with woofer and tweeter pairs in each corner, they sound amazing, and they offer wide stereo output. Gigabit class LTE and eSIM technology in our cellular models for great connectivity wherever you go. The 11-inch iPad Pro is offered in these four storage options, and it starts at $799. The 12.9-inch iPad Pro is offered in these same storage options, and it starts at $999. Customers can start placing orders today. And they're going to be showing up next week on the 7th. Now, in addition to the new Pro, the current 10.5-inch Pro will continue to be available alongside the 6th-gen iPad and iPad Mini 4.